All right, uh, picked up one of these things. You remember them? Uh, the iCade. I uh, won it in the eBay auction for ten bucks. So uh, after I got this, that's what kind of wanted made me want to get uh, start building an actual cabinet or a bar top bar top arcade or whatever. And I hate that. <laughs> um. I figure out what's going wrong there. I mapped the button, so it's probably something wrong with it. But uh, yeah, this is just a Chinese tablet. The uh, problem with the um, with this uh, IK on Android. This is Android. It looks like an iPad, but it's Android. I think I mentioned that, but it's a Chinese knockoff tablet, but it also runs Windows. Ugh. Um, get out of here. Hard to talk and, and play at the same time. Okay. So anyways, uh, the problem with this uh, IK here is that if you're running the, the latest version, at least Nougat that I know of, um, it will pair, but it won't work uh, in supported applications. So even though it's paired, oh, press the wrong buttons. Oh, I know what I did wrong with the mapping. I think this in these are both mapped to start and select, and yeah. So I need to remap it. But anyways. It's working on KitKat, so if you have an old KitKat device, that's I got it for this because it has a 4x3 screen, and I don't really use it much, so I just got my ass kicked. But yeah. Damn you. The weird thing about this tablet is... Ah, fuck. I got I'm trying to stay out of the, the way of the, the picture with the camera. I don't know if I'm doing that, but it's making it a little hard to play. Um, but yeah, you get to see a fatality. Um, get out of here. It's a little hard to see. There, there's no button on here that I can map to exit. There are some hotkeys, but um, I have to guess. Okay, that's it. I can't see the exit button, but I'm also using a. Um, modifications as well as a um, game sum because it's the only uh, front end that supports 4x3 and this version of Android so none of the other front ends for Android would work so I had to use game sum also this device for some reason doesn't notice your in-app purchases I own game sums paid version but it doesn't see it and GameSum does not support the iCade's controls. Uh, but what was I talking about? Something else. So it was Android, something, and oh, this device in general. Um, it's a little screwy. It's, an, it's a Chinese device. It does have the same screen as the iPad Air and Air 2, I think, or whatever. But So it looks really nice. But um, if I don't plug it in, it doesn't give me the full performance. So I guess it's trying to ba do battery saving. And... Um, It'll start lagging when uh, when unplugged, uh, when playing emulators, and it will also, uh, t even if it gets the slightest bit warm, it will give me a message telling me that it's like, it, you know, it's basically too hot and it's gonna like thermal shutdown, it gives me this kind of thermal shutdown message and then it just shuts off, so I have to keep it plugged in or it will do that. <laughs> so that's that's one annoyance, but that's the tablet, so. But yeah, it does work with um, main for Droid. It works with say uh, with the .mu series. I tried RetroArch. It won't map. I can't get it. It doesn't do the auto mapping thing, and I can't map it myself because each button sends two um, two inputs. And so when so say I press down, it will map. It'll ask me to say ma you know map this button. Press down. Okay. It maps that button, lift up, it maps the next button, 
and that makes everything screwy, so I, you can't math it. So that's the kind of idea there. Each button sends two specific mappings, and it has to be specifically supported, or it just won't work right. MAME is fine, and it maps okay, but uh, you need the .mu series uh, to launch, like, say, Sega Genesis games. I added some uh, Sega Genesis games that I thought would be make great arcade, great arcadey type games. Streets of Rage 2 works great with uh, with this kind of thing. Um, remember how I? Okay, yeah. So this is a great game for um, for this type of control scheme. Reminds me of a game that's actually in the arcades. Another thing is I have a little trouble with button combinations. They don't always work right. Let's see if I can... Oh, I did it. Cool. Sometimes they don't... You know, it could be a little rough trying to get the button combinations to work. So... But yeah, you can get it out to work on a KitKat device. And it was 10 bucks, so I figured I'd give it a shot. Seems very good condition, too. If you go on Amazon, they're, over, they're like anywhere from 60 to over 100 bucks. Used. Then you have Golden Axe 2 and stuff, which I don't think was ever in the arcades, quite sure. Just the first one. This thing likes to come off. That happened, I had the IK core, and that ball always came off. It always, you had to be careful with it, you had to like keep screwing it on. This is awesome to play with like this, and I can't wait to set up my my bar top arcade and, and start playing these games. But see, this is the same thing that happened with my IK Core. When I had my IK Core, I had an iPad Mini, and that got stolen. My house got robbed, and when that happened, uh, I kind of. Tried to hook my IK Core up uh, to the to an Android device I had, but it wouldn't pair. So that led me to sell the IK Core. But this one is a lot better, just because it looks like a real arcade almost. <laughs> so, but with the with the bar top arcade that I'm creating, I'll be able to play. Not only these types of games, but also, uh, you know, any newer fighting games and things like that. Because I'm going to be streaming it from my PC using the uh, Steam Link. I got the the screen in, which was going to, uh, which was the hard part. That was the part where the screen didn't fit, so I had to make it fit, and I had to create slots in the side of the the uh, wood. Um, to to accept the uh, the arcade uh, the, the screen. Now I just have to work on making it look nice because <laughs> it comes a little just the slightest bit out of the side. So I have to kind of blend it in a little, and I'm going to make it like part of the uh, side art. Then I'm going to get my buttons eventually. But while I'm waiting on that. This will this will hold me over, I guess. I keep picking up chicken when I'm not like almost dead, or turkey, or whatever it is. A 
Okay, I think I'm gonna get out of here. Is there any way to exit? No. Okay. I'm gonna have to exit out. I wanna go into another game. Um. What do I wanna do? I wanna do something that's an arcade game. Um. Let's do this. There's other versions of this game that allow you to play with someone other than Marge. Come on. Is this in free play mode? I forgot. But I don't want to play Marge. Uh, I'll have to figure out which version I can set up, but right now I'm stuck with Marge. Unless I guess I can you know, map it to the player that I want. So when I start, it'll be like Homer or something. I forgot if this is set to free play. Oh, if you want the menu, you do that. So, let's see if I can get to the... Yeah, I think it's service? Yeah, service. But unfortunately, that actually there is no free play for this. It's only... It doesn't... As far as I see, there is no free play. Go in here. Where the hell are you? Okay. It says starting coin. Yeah. So there's no way to get free play that I see. Yep. Go into premium settings. That's like, yeah, it's nothing. You get nothing and like it. Go to exit. There's number of players. Four players. If there's any way to. Yeah, there's no way to change it to uh, let me choose a player. Um, sound in attract mode. Video screen flip normal. Yeah, there's really nothing. I can't set it to free play. Start without start buttons. Uh, yeah. Yeah, no, no free play. Anyways, and you're stuck with Marge. I'm broke now. Too many quarters. I just gotta remember which buttons to press. Raggy. I guess it's this one. Okay. So yeah, yay. Hey, off. Raggy. Hey. <laughs> oh fuck. Hey, what the hell is this? You're hitting women? This game is about killing women. Marge is a big SJW. Okay. Not a problem pounding on the buttons. Haha, -ha, I have infinite coins and you can't stop me. Okay, he's wearing panties, that's great. It's very sexy. Pink panties.
Yeah, so what? I have 41 other marges, so you can't stop me. There you go. Okay, so that, I guess that's the end of the video. I uh, was just showing that thing and stuff. Kind of a, another way of, you know, playing on an arcade cabinet for cheap. Because I got, uh, Hey! I didn't press enough buttons. Anyways.